Hey everybody and welcome to our part one of how to open a CL site. So I am out in the field where the CL site is going to be. It's opposite the house so it's not on the house side. Um, we've got a few jobs that we need to get done but I also want to tell you the steps we've had to take so far. So we've been thinking about this for a while and um, we thought well why not let's let's take the plunge and give it a go and worst case if we don't like it we just stop um so what we did initially we rang the caravan and motorhome club we had a few questions we wanted to ask and we wanted to find out exactly what we needed if what we had was good enough and what to do so a really lovely lady we spoke to who basically said um you go on to the caravan and motorhome club web page and there's a link on there to um i can't remember what it said i think it's um apply for a cl site or something like that so you click on it answer a few questions and put your details in and literally within a day or two we had a response um, and a date was set for someone to come out and have a look at the potential cl site so he came out that was a week ago today he came out um he had a good look and had a good chat I couldn't make all the meetings because I was working. Um, he had a good chat with Damien and he said it was perfect. Perfect access, perfect build. There is some work we need to do, obviously, um, but that it was great, great potential. So we've got some work crew coming down for a day and we're going to get cracking. We need to open up the gateway. We need to cut the grass. Those are kind of the first jobs, really, because um, it's quite overgrown. So. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy seeing what we've got up to so far. Okay, so one of the first steps that we need to do in the field, we should have actually a before picture. I mean, you might get the idea, but um, we need to cut all this grass because it's been left unused for so long. I mean, the horses don't graze on here. Look, it's just got long and scraggly. So Damien's starting by just chopping it up. And then once he's done, I'll show you again. The gateway's down there, so that's the access will be when it's all cut back nice big gateway there yeah and there's our horses do just a little view from the other end of the field so I'm at the far end looking back down it's probably cut about half of the grass now there's that bit in the middle left The work crew were here for the day and we are going to make a start on opening up the gateway. Hi John. Hi, What's Good more morning. lethal, the fact that I'm carrying petrol in this hand or a chainsaw in this hand? What's, what, what, what do you think is more lethal? <laughs> us, three, us three together. Yeah, you three together. Then you said that the only thing I'm entrusted with today is the rake and he can't oh. find the rake. can't find the rake. Oh. No idea where that's gone. It's going well, isn't it, Damien? So a little before of what it's like, very overgrown, there's some tree, bits of the tree that need to come down to open it up, there is a gate down there, so we will show you later on the progress. going to be some fire. Not as good as Holly Fest though, that took me months to build that one. Well as a project manager it's going very well, I'm just delegating more work for the boys to do. If you swing around you can see that I've got the guys there loading up nicely in the background um, and I must admit it's about time for me to go and have a, uh, a drinky, I think, and a bacon butter bacon button. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, it's, it's hard work standing here doing nothing. 
It is. If that was only the case. We're burning the wood though. Swing round, Kel. This is what, look what we cut out already. Doesn't look very impressive, does it? It's quite a lot though, only from a little bit. Most of it's still down there. We've got to drag it out in a minute, but we're going to get the fire going and then I'm going to start dragging it out in a bit. Cool, going to be some fire that. Yeah, it's going to be all right, isn't it? The idea is that we get it long and low to go through the rest of the day and we can just keep piling the wood on. So we're going to hopefully get as far down to that tree as we possibly can, I think. Yeah, that'd be good. And then we've got dinner already scheduled for tonight. Yes. What's that then? I, I don't actually know what it is. What's Jan making? I think Jan is making a Hungarian goulash. Oh, is it? Yeah. Andrew's made the... With some um, roast potatoes. Oh, I think she's Hungarian. doing roast, roast potatoes. Um, yeah. Andrew's already made the cheesecake. Yeah, it looks good, that does. <laughs> the wood's coming off. Oh my god, look at It's a bit like a tragic Titanic, <laughs> isn't it? Oh my god. <laughs> look, 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 it's all coming off. He's shedding the shed. You missed a bit. <laughs> you gotta go, got to go back, it fell you off. got to go back, loads of it's fallen off. progress so far the fire's going well got quite a few bits chopped down John's being Tarzan So it's Sunday today, it's the day after our work crew came and helped us for the day and the video kind of ended a bit bluntly so I thought I'd come back over today and show you exactly what got done and what it looks like now and um, yeah just end, end the video really. So just showing you the access, now we've cleared the gateway, this will be the access, we have got a little bit more to do but this is, um, this, we've made a good start. But that's the nice big gateway up into the field and I will show you from the other side what it looks like now okay and this is what it looks like from this side so we've cleared a really big chunk and we've got quite a few of the trees down there and the fire did good but I think I think it's gone out now it was still going yesterday but we've had a couple of really frosty nights now so um, that's gone out but we're going to slowly work our way along this hedge line just tidying everything up all the way along so that's um sort of our next job really but um i hope you've enjoyed stage one of getting the land ready for a cl site and what we've been up to let me know your thoughts down below and um we look forward to sharing the next step with you okay bye guys